With the 4th of July falling on a Tuesday, many are making this a long weekend. And there are some fun things to do if you are sticking around town. Sarah Warner of Destination Madison is here to highlight a few. And let's start tomorrow night. The bodega returns to Breeze Stevens Field. That's Hopefully right. the wet, the air quality continues to improve. Yeah, keep an eye on that. Yeah. But over 100 vendors in its seventh cool. year at Breeze Stevens. Uh, lots of food carts, family games, and uh, they, they encourage friendly family competition with the yard game. Love it. Um, and uh, some beer, wine, music. It should be a good time. And you can support a lot of local makers and vendors. Anything from antiques to microgreens to art. I love it. Why not support local businesses and great because it's all in one stop, <laughs> yeah, right. you know, to drive all over the place. Okay, both tomorrow and Saturday is an immersive dance festival. Tell me more about this out at Four Winds, which is a really cool venue. Yeah, it's beautiful and it's a cool kind of farm, permaculture farm as well. But their 8,900 8, square foot barn is renovated and Lee Chao Ping will be doing workshops throughout the weekend. Or they've already started, I believe, but there are two public free performances on Friday and Saturday night. So it's part of the Seed Festival, which is summer exploratory experimental dance. Cool. So it'll be fun to check out some images from last year's. So who parts who do, who is the performance? Is it local people or is it a group that comes in? It's local. Uh, Lee Chao Ping is actually a resident organization at Overture Center mm -hmm. and so they're doing they do this in the summertime as just an offering to students. How cool. Yeah. That would be a fun thing to check out. Okay, if you have a dog or more than one and you enjoy live music, there is a great option on Saturday. Saturday at the phone yard. Um, yeah, and it, it's free for humans and you don't have to have dogs to go, but there is a salsa soul kind of mix up local band that will get everybody dancing, including those little pups. I've never been there, but I've heard one of my coworkers was saying it's a really cool spot. Yeah, lots of beer. There'll be a lot of food trucks there available for everyone to eat and dance and have a good time. Love it. And finally, to celebrate the 4th, the Monona Community Festival. This is a really big, long-running tradition. It is, and uh, it's the Wisconsin Wife Carry Competition, too, is part of it. Doesn't oh, my gosh, I've seen video of that in the past. <laughs> yes. It doesn't have to be wife. It can be husband. It can be partner. <laughs> it can be spouse. Uh, whatever, but could it be yeah. your young kids? See, that's what I would do because that'd be easy. easier. Right, Try it. I right. Don't know. Yeah. No rules here. There you go. Look at that. No rules. Um, <laughs> yeah. So the, there's fireworks, of course, all sorts of food, music, some mini golf, uh, no, whatever you can imagine for the three days. So. Uh, Make sure you check something out to celebrate the holiday. Absolutely. Lots of opportunities there. And I hope you have a nice holiday. You too. Thank yeah. you. Happy 4th. 